Hello everyone, this is Al Cabeda Analyst and today I will be talking Dallas Goddard and him getting sucker punch at a restaurant in South Dakota. Sucker punch. But this is Al Cabeda Analyst. I wanted to talk about this because this is what really, really pisses me off about just human beings and fans in general, man. God with his family, his lovely family. They going out to eat in South Dakota. I think he's from around that area. I believe North Dakota to be exact. But um, because I've seen a lot of stuff. Why is he in that area? Why is he in South Dakota? Things like that. That's where his family is from. From North Dakota, South Dakota is right there. So more than likely, that's probably a restaurant he went to before. But now um he he just has to be more careful because he he's a celebrity now he plays for a high name team the philadelphia eagles and randomly saw some loser just punches him in the face why don't know he get hospitalized now if the roles were reversed and he punched that guy in the face and then it would have been like, oh, he's a football player. He's so much bigger than that guy. Why would he do that? And I hate the double standards when it comes to football players, even if he was a cowboy or a giant or a redskin. And I hate those teams. But just to punch a guy in his face for no reason with his family unprovoked, and then he has to go to the hospital to see if he's concussed or not. Like, come on, man. Like, stop it, people, stop it. And this guy, Dallas Goddard, just came off a good season with 58 catches, 607 yards, and five TDs just in his second year. So this guy, he, he's really good, man, especially being second fiddle to Zach Ertz. And this is what happens to him when he's out to eat, just get punched in the face. Like, come on, people, just... To stop it. I did read all the jokes, all the Cowboys fan ran up on him, or Eagles players always getting hurt. Yeah, it's all jokes and all, but in all seriousness, man, this guy didn't deserve this. He, he's the S factor for the Eagles. Just out with his family. Just imagine being out with your family and the guys just punch you for no reason. Literally no reason. So, um, I'll press to Dallas Goddard. Just got to move differently maybe move with more security to avoid that from happening it's sad to live like that but i guess that's what's being a celebrity in america is people do stupid things to go viral or stupid things to make headlines um i guess that's america for you but just be safe out there dallas goddard and hopefully you know you're fine. I was reading reports that you are fine, Dallas Goddard. So just keep your head up and, you know, once again, once you travel out, just always have security with you. You never know what's on these people's mind. Now he's probably paranoid to take pictures with fans. Um, this is a very sad case, but he's good. So I'm not going to try to um, downplay it too much. You know, the jokes were very funny again. But tell me what you think. Um, do you think the fan is wrong? Or do you think Dallas Goddard should have punched this guy back and got a lawsuit? But this is Alcabeta Analyst, and I am Ghost.